M0FXB Yesu FTM 500. Let's enter our manual GPS position. First thing you do is hold down function and then go down to APRS. The quickest way to go down is to turn the bottom knob here, the sub knob, because that will change the categories at the top APRS, SD card, ETC. So go down until you see APRS. Then with the function knob, scroll down until you see quite low my position set and then you've got my position so let's select my position number 97 this is where we're going to add our position the back button is under here if I go back up one to 96 have a look there and in this we can set whether we want it to be manual or GPS. Now I'm not getting a GPS lock, so it makes sense to use manual. Turn the function knob to the left, select that, press the function, then go down to 97 and press again. So to set our position, we can look it up, look up our position using Google really, just type in my position and you'll find it. I actually use the ICOM app, which is the ST4002A, it's a free download from ICOM and when you start it, it shows you your location and the other nice thing is with the ICOM 7100, 9100, 9700, 4100, 5100, it will act as a GPS so you connect via cable or Ethernet, whichever is selectable and it will actually add the GPS location to your device. Anyway, back to this, so we'll just back out show you how we got to it again, back out, hold down function, scroll down to 97, press my position, and then once you're in the latitude, which is highlighted in red, press function, and then you can start scrolling right and left here. We can select north or south, and in my case, the position is north, then you just go across, start to select your numbers there, so you go five, one, three, six, and you can move to the right or the left with these arrows. When you've selected that one, hold down the function. Now turn the function knob to highlight the longitude in red. Press the function again, choose east or west. I am west, so we go west. And we can start to go along and again just type in the numbers of your location that's my location and when you're done just hold down the function again and then you can just back out with the back button you're all set now and just out of interest while we're here we'll go up to 96 press my position and we'll change it to GPS and then we'll back out. And what you should see is when it does find the lock, the GPS symbol will appear. And once that starts to appear, then you can make selections and start viewing your GPS details. Okay, thanks for watching my channel, 7-3, all the best.